three days in, the Red Bull X Alps adventure continues. Strengthening winds favoured the brave, but timing was everything. Heli Eichholzer got it badly wrong. He was forced instead to play catch up on the ground. On top of the Dachstein, it was really heavy, windy conditions. So I decided to hike down and fly towards Ramsau. It was not a good day for Christian Amon either. The Austrian was forced to quit the race early yet again. His knees were knackered. Wenn ich jetzt draufsteig draußen, ja, ja. Wenn ich jetzt da draufsteig, da kriege ich einen Stich von von da bis da oben mhm. auf all zwei Seiten. Mhm. Da. Okay, das This is the classic overstress syndrome. 2,000 meters of hiking downhill where the upper leg muscles get inflamed and they hurt really badly. Kaoru Ogisawa from Japan also got bad news. He'd infringed airspace and was disqualified from the race. The rest of the field though, there was still prey to hunt. Mike Kuhn, normally seen putting on acro shows, was now putting in some serious grunt on the ground. South Africa's Pierre Carter and the USA's Honza Raymanek teamed up together to take on the Grossglockner. But however hard they tried, one man was always two steps ahead. You have to take your hat off to him. Christian Maurer took off in atrociously windy conditions. 